the point in the narrow river canyons where fast-flowing rapids make the job too strenuous for a single team, the boats are temporarily anchored, and the coolie teams combine efforts to pull a single boat at a time through the difficult stretch. The coolies chant a song similar to that of the Volga boatmen to help them pull in unison. Shortage of normal facilities forces our army to use every available means of Chinese transportation. These coolie carts are used to bring empty gasoline drums from the airfield to various alcohol factories. Alcohol is the main fuel for American convoys and has to be transported from the factories about 150 miles to our supply base. Filled drums in the storehouse. The drums are reshipped by means of mule cart trains. Arriving at the American convoy station near our supply base, a GI and a Chinese contractor check the load. Filling the tank of a convoy truck. A convoy on the way to the alcohol factories waits to be ferried across the Luho River. Oars made of unshaped poles reveal the extremely primitive facilities in use. Reaching the other side of the river, Observers report this to be the sort of transportation our armies will encounter as they penetrate the interior of China. <laughs> 